Ladies and gentlemen, how can I hear some? The son of Wiki is 60 years. We cannot do it. So they gathered in Potter Court to celebrate him. And as I know celebration, he said the president goes to like, have you made some statement? He said, you don't know why Fubara, they quarrel with Wiki. According to him, Fubara is fighting uh, policies of betrayal and this and that. He said, but Wiki is a peaceful man. <laughs> And no human being should be quarreling with Wiki because Wiki is a peaceful man and a good man. Let me show you this. Let me recognize now the man of the woman, the celebrant, my brother, Senator. Ah, I, I hope I don't make that mistake again. <laughs> Always making mistake. Right Honorable, because he was local government chairman, right Honorable Minister. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Wiki. The Minister of Ministers. Yeah. For those of you who may not understand uh, politics, uh, we were taught, even while in school, that the parliament can turn a woman into a man mm -hmm. and a man into a, a woman. woman. And as a governor, my greatest fear was my house of assembly. Okay. So because of that, I never travel anywhere without my speaker. Okay. <laughs> Very necessary. So any anytime I don't see him for a day, I'll send somebody to his house to find out. So he can go yes, so he can go and have lunch with me. Then, then I'll use the idea to look at his face, whether he was happy with me or not. You have problem with it. <laughs> so because the only place that can hurt the governor is the house of uh, assembly. assembly. And no court, no democracy can stop that from happening. I hope you know that. Of course. I see the pen down. Sensational. Sensational. See the cash out. Any any uh, president that wants to survive, like as Wajju Bola Metunibu, must hold his speaker and his senate president very closely, like he's holding us. That is the truth. Recently, he conferred on us GCUN, two of us, Grand Commander of the Order of the Niger. Whether he, he loved it or not, he did it. <laughs> he has to. You must hold your, the two chambers together. <laughs> so, I don't know what is happening in Riverside, but I do hope that the successor to Yeso Wike realizes the fact that no matter how the bird flies, the legs are pointing to the ground. Mm. Uh, something, something must be wrong. So I don't care what people say, but we must try to stop this politics of betrayal mm -hmm. and politics of treachery. Okay. Because it does not even allow for good succession. Yes. Prof, in everything you said here, the word that was missing was sustainability. You can have sustainability in good policies and governance when the person taking over from you is interested in not destroying you alone, but destroying everything that you did. Mm. After I come and ask me, and I will tell you, when men say there's a casting down, God upstairs says, though, there's a lifting up. Mm -hmm. but it doesn't lift you up because you know how to abuse people. He lifts you up because so he knows that, heart, that your heart is pure. I was discussing with some of my colleague senators and I said, I don't know how somebody will quarrel with a man like this. If he shouts here, even while we are sitting there, by the time I get to that door, he has forgotten. <laughs> he will be the one to carry the phone and call me and said, so when are you coming to the house for lunch? And he has forgotten that we quarrel. Then I'll tell him after the quarrel. <laughs> <laughs> So it's simple, you have become the governor, you have done your eight years, move on. As they talk now, you'll be governor for Abuja. Move on. If he's a very peaceful man, how come he's quarreling with all his successors? Because as I'm talking to you now, he's not in good terms with Amishi. He's not in good terms with Peter Odili. He's not in good terms with Fubara. So who is he now in good terms with? The only reason why they are bad be the single praise now is because he is carrying the whole support he has and giving it to APC. 
Nobody is totally bad, no matter how bad you are as a man. You get some people when your badness the favor. It is why you will see all these APC members singing wicked praise because the badness or the bad character of a wicked they favor them. But I'm going to tell the truth, you won't do it too much. You don't know the duty, you don't do too much. Like I've always said in all my videos, the problem in they give people for a pusher when you don't do any favor for when will they see the problem they give them now. Only God knows the kind of problem when they give the man when they do favor for for river state. We made the matter say enough is enough. So it's all like we can call the man a betrayer all we want. But the truth is somebody needs to call wicked to order. All this on a plane. Well, we get all old now. Look at 60. And he has been in government since 1999. 1999 to this 25 years. So he became a local government chairman when he was just 35. He has lived all his life as a police. Hey, now, wow. I've been a wrong industry. I enter my whole star politics because if I start from now, before I reach 60, I will become president. He's well. He's a good infrastructure man. He does constructions. He develops areas. We agree. But the side disadvantage of him being in power. And taking charge is not the over plenty. See the people is rendering poor in Abuja. People's land is revoking. People's full life investment. So because say you are doing something good, another person will now leave his eyes open for you to shook on this side. And then when the person says no, you can't shook on their eye, we'll call the person a betrayer. Muna tell her truth.